the propaganda has so changed people's expressed attitudes, whatever their actual attitudes are, that uh, uh, even the mild reforms of the uh, Affordable Care Act, which are some kind of a step forward, they don't really deal with the problem, uh, even those are opposed. And you think that in not that many years ago, like 1990, 40% uh, of the population thought there was a, a constitutional guarantee for public health care. This is a tremendous triumph of propaganda. And we've created a system now where it is so easy to flood so much money into the communication process, Citizens United, McCutcheon, all these decisions of the courts, which whatever minimal barriers are now down, that you, know, you hear the Koch brothers planning to spend close to a billion dollars in the next election, then you find out they spend hundreds of millions to do, to do just these things, to take apart. And some of the things that have been done are, are really sophisticated. Uh, there's, uh, there's an interesting study by uh, Suzanne Mettler, Cornell University a sociologist, called The Submerged State. And what she shows pretty convincingly is that there's been a change from visible government programs of reform and, uh, subsist and uh, subsidy and support, where you see that the government is doing something for you, to indirect means which, where you don't see that the government is doing it. What you see is some private entity doing it, which is being subsidized by the government. Mm -hmm. And the end result is that people think the government is, not, is harming them. It's not helping them. And of course, as, these, as this submerged state develops, turns out most of the subsidies are going to the wealthy. Uh, so for example, the, uh, um, uh, the home mortgage interest uh, deduction, which is a very substantial sum of money, overwhelmingly it goes to the wealthy. Uh, in the uh, uh, education, the, the, uh, the, the for-profit educational system, which is a big thing here, uh, most of it, most of the funding comes from the taxpayer, but you don't see it, you know. And of course, it's going to the corporations, That's not the, you know. And there's uh, devices like that all across the country. The result is that uh, if, some strange results. Uh, people who are most subsidized by the government tend to be most opposed to government subsidy. <laughs> uh, so uh, 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 it's very oh, yeah. striking. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Do they not know they are subsidized, or are they just you, cynical? You don't know. They do not because, know. I mean, who would know that uh, a tax deduction for employer uh, uh, health insurance is a huge subsidy to the corporations, or that the home mortgage deduction is a subsidy to the wealthy? I mean, you can figure it out if you think about it, but it's not obvious on the surface, and that goes case by case.